Welcome back. This is level 12 of Descent 3, the PTMC Proving Grounds. What are we doing here? Why are we here? Well, if you remember in the last video, we got captured after we rescued that pilot from Titan, and we have been taken here to the PTMC Proving Grounds in Charon. And we're currently being tortured with flame. And we're locked in place, so I can't move, but I can look around. And what we gotta do here is destroy this, uh, torture device by shooting at the open jets. Alright, now to shoot the, uh, central jet. There we go. And once the torture mechanism is destroyed, the uh, generators that power up this locking mechanism, or whatever you want to call it, is exposed. And the only way we can shoot at them is by shooting at this force field. Or I should say, these force fields. But you gotta aim precisely. It's hard to tell what you're aiming at, because you can't see uh, the generators, except for in the uh, cutscene. Uh, the introduction cutscene of this level. And there we go. We are free. Now we have to make our way out of this, uh, out of the proving grounds. You know, it's weird how Dravis captures the material defender and. Yeah. He captured the material defender and instead of actually killing him on the spot or at the very least separating him from this ship, he chose to keep him inside the ship and just torture him with flames. I mean, what's up with that, Dravis? Alright, shit, the closing device is gone. And now we got all these robots to fight. Holy crap, so many of them. Oh, you know what? This will be a perfect time to demonstrate the Black Shark Missile! <laughs> oh, yeah, I love that. I fucking love that. The Black Shark Missile is easily the best weapon in this entire game. And there are more, uh, more robots spawning. So, let me pick up the remaining homing missiles. And get the heck out of here. Yeah, there is a materializer up there that keeps spawning all these robots, so I'm not going to bother fighting them all. Because they'll just keep spawning. Yeah, unlike in the previous Descent game, where the materializers have, uh, uh, can only spawn a limited amount of robots, in this game, uh, the materializer spawned infinite, uh, infinitely. The spawned robot infinitely. Uh, sorry about that. I'm so distracted by the robots, I'm having trouble speaking right now. There we go. Yep, just spawned some, uh, cubs now, so I'm not gonna fight them. I'm just gonna grab what I can and make a run for it. So yeah, now we have to, um... Uh, make our way through the Proving Grounds and get the hell out of here. And in order to get out, we have to, uh fight certain robots in order to uh, prove ourselves worthy. Yeah, there's, there's the different uh, mini-boss robots that you have to fight, and um, in order to enter the arena, you need to pick up keys. So now we have to look around for a key for, uh, uh, for the level 1 arena. Oh, happy April Fool Day, everybody! Yep, today is April 1st. And today is a holiday that I don't really- OW! 
Yeah, a holiday I don't really ow. <laughs> no, a holiday I don't really celebrate. Um, oop! I saw the level one key and it's being guarded by homing missile turrets. Let's see if I can snipe them. I think I got them. Yep. That went well. And here is the level 1 key. So now we can enter the uh, level 1 arena. But anyway, yeah, today is April Fool Day. Today is the day I don't really celebrate. But uh, there are already some weird shit going on already. Like, uh, like in TF2, there's... Uh, uh, the taunts are replaced by the, uh, the Schadenfreude taunt. I'm gonna go in here for some secrets. Not really any point in being here, but, uh, I just want to grab a couple of things. And, uh... And the Draconic server forums. Uh, everything's upside down. The entire website's upside down! <laughs> But thankfully, I can read things uh, that are upside down very easily. Hell, I can just fly around like this and still have no problem getting around. Only problem is, in Descent 3, I can't actually fly upside down for very long because my ship automatically uh, rights itself. But anyway, let's go inside the first arena and face the first opponent. And our first opponent is Mega Stinger. Yeah, basically all of our opponents in this level are just uh, heavily upgraded versions of regular robots we encounter. This version of the Stinger fires two homing missiles simultaneously and moves a lot, lot faster. And the best weapon to use against him is the Omega Cannon because most of the time he'll just run up to you and uh, try to melee you. Get some energy. Okay, try to pin me against the wall, but that was a big, big mistake. Thank God I survived that. Oh, and there's this thing. Yeah, that's the uh, <laughs> that's the gong that we hear at the beginning of each battle. So we cleared we cleared level one. Now let's head off to level two prepare ourselves for the next arena battle. Uh, let's go this way first. Cut the key is this way. Yep, there it is. Yeah, all the keys in this level are guarded by uh, homing missile um, turrets. Alright, one down, one to go. There we go. Got the level 2 key. Now let's head to the level 2 arena. Oh, what can I talk about here? Um, I really have nothing to talk about. I mean, yeah, one of the reasons I delayed... Uh, uh, the video, just so I can have a specific conversation to talk about, but, um, I really don't want to keep you guys waiting. And what is that over there? A couple of green lights, and, uh, large area with a force field up top. Yeah, this is the, f uh, the final opponent that we will be facing, and this is a boss fight. And who is it, you're wondering? Well, you'll see later on. <laughs> And I really like this level because of how friendly the robots are. Yeah. They won't attack me unless I attack them first. 
Okay, I'm just bumping into this guy and he doesn't give a shit. Uh, if only this was possible in Descent 1 and 2. Oh, actually it is possible. Oh, these guys are not friendly. Yeah, some robots are friendly, as in they won't shoot you. Some robots are not friendly. So anyway... Uh, here is level 2 arena. Now, let's go inside. Mo, mo, mo! Uh, can I squeeze right through? Okay, I can't. Now for the second battle, we have a Mega Thresher. And this is a very easy battle. <laughs> yeah, one Mega Missile is all it takes to take out that robot. Alright. Ah! Okay. That took me by surprise a bit. <laughs> Alright, now, off to the level 3 arena. Oh, there's a level 3 key right there. Here, let's use this. There we go. Oh so yeah, sorry if I don't have a particular topic to talk about. Um, I really don't want to keep you guys waiting for the next video, and, um, yeah, a lot of people, uh, I'm pretty sure some of you are interested in hearing me, to hear me talk about something interesting rather than just, uh, not talk about something at all, but anyway. Alright, level 3 arena, we have Mega 6 Gun. And he's armed with the super lasers of this game, of Descent 3. Which is the level 5 lasers of Descent 2. But again, very easy opponent. Now for level 4. Um, yeah. Math driver because the level 4 key is right over here and being guarded by homing missile turrets. There we are. Alright, now which way to go? We can go right or we can go left. Well, let's go right first since we're closer to this door. And here fight we're fighting a uh, a mega tail bot. We're armed with frag missile. And this is a very dangerous opponent. Whoa! Lag? No. Now's not the time to lag, game. Yeah, fighting the robot that fires frag missiles. Very, very dangerous. Because how much damage the, uh, the frag missile can do. But anyway, we cleared that robot, and we can go down here now. But... If there's an arena on this side of the fourth level, then what's over here on the other side? Well, let's go inside and take a look. It's another tail bot, or mega tail bot. And this time when we beat him, we get a bonus. Oh, 
Oh wow! I killed him much quicker than the uh, the previous Mega Tail Bot. So yeah, upon defeating the second Mega Tail Bot, we get to go in here into the secret area, and look what we have here: a data cartridge. Let's go ahead and take a look. This cartridge is pretty worn and badly rusted, but your guide bot manages to extract some data that may be useful. It refers to some sort of covert industrial complex that doesn't appear on any of your nav charts. It may be worth checking out later. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the ticket to the second secret level of Descent 3. But anyway... Let's go ahead and uh, make our way to the next part of the level. To the final fight. Yep, the final fight is coming up shortly. But in order to fight the, uh, the boss, which is referred to as the champion of this level, we have to fight off all the uh, competitors looking to fight him. And what do you know? It's the four... Robot that we fought previously. Mega Tailbot, Mega Thresher, Mega Stinger, and Mega Six Gun. And they start off friendly for some reason, even though they're all lining up to fight the, uh, the Proven Ground Champion. But like before, they won't start attacking unless I attack first. So yeah, we have to destroy all four of those robots in order to go into the championship arena and fight the champions. Ow. Alright, one down, three to go. Oh, looks like this guy's stuck. Two down, two to go. Oh! Ah! Oh, shit. Mega Thresher. Or, Stinger. Yeah, you deserve that. Alright, now for the Mega Thresher. I'll fight you with your own weapon. Yeah, the difference between this Thresher and the regular Thresher is that it fires the fusion cannon slightly faster and uh, had much more shield. But with all of the uh, championship competitors destroyed, we can now enter the final arena. But I want to look around and see if there's any uh, shield that I can pick up. And it doesn't look like there is. Oh well, let's go inside and meet the boss of the PTMC Proven Ground. Yep, say hello to the PTMC Proven Ground Champion, also known as the Dragon, or uh, the advanced assault mech as it was called in the first level of this game where we saw a picture of this very robot in one of the uh, terminals I'll go and use the black shark missile on him so yeah, it shoots the lasers at you and if you get up close to it It'll shoot napalm at you. Yeah, it's got a flamethrower. How badass is that? And I don't have a lot of shield, so I gotta be careful. Okay, I think it's almost dead. Come on, come on, come on, come on. And they rocket. Oh. 
There we go. The champion is defeated. And now we can finally make our way out. We are free from the PTMC Proving Grounds. And that was the PTMC Proving Ground. Quite a fun little level. But I still think it's very weird that Dravis decided to send the Material Defender here instead of just kill him. Or at the very least, separate him from his ship. Yeah, Dravis is not a very smart villain. That's just about as smart as the Cyclos from Battlefield Earth. God, why am I bringing up Battlefield Earth? That's such a horrible movie. Anyway... All done with that level. You defeated the dragon and escaped from the Proving Ground. We're glad to have you back. I'm glad to be back too, Beagle. Chapter S2, Secret Area 2. The data cartridge that you picked up contains a location of a secret area that might be worth checking out. We have no information on this location. Keep your eyes open. Yep, this is the second and final secret level of this game. And since I took the Phoenix in the previous uh, secret level, I'm going to take the Magnum for this secret level. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and save my game right here. And I will see you guys next time as we do the second and final secret level of Descent 3. See you later!